experimental catapult designed to launch World War II bomber planes into the sky has been excavated. The prototype Royal Aircraft Establishment Mark III catapult was unearthed at the site of development at the Harwell Science and Innovation Campus in Oxfordshire. It was meant to enable takeoffs using shorter runways and so the planes could be loaded with more fuel. The contraption was built between 1938 and 1940 when the site was RAF Harwell. However, the project was abandoned without ever launching an aircraft because the engines would wear out and the designer did not properly fit the bomber planes. The mechanism was taken out and a normal runway built over the top. The technology was a precursor to catapult armed merchant cam ships, which launched Hawker Hurricanes at sea via rocket propelled catapults. How was the catapult meant to work? A large rotating turntable directed aircraft towards one of the concrete track runways, only 82 metres or 269 feet long. The aircraft was attached to an underground pneumatic ram using a towing hook. Underneath the turntable, Rolls Royce Kestrel Aero engines compressed air to 2000 psi to drive the ram. High pressured air was forced into the pneumatic ram which rapidly expanded to the length of the guided track and the bomber would then be catapulted into the sky. Archaeologists at the Museum of London Archaeology, MOLA, have now recreated a 3D digital wrapper of the remains. Project officer Susan Porter said that this fascinating structure reminds us of the rapid experimentation and innovation of the interwar years and World War II. Crucially, recording the location and appearance of every inch means that the catapult is preserved by record for future generations. The catapult has now been dismantled to allow construction works in the area to continue, though the remains are being archived. Excavations also uncovered large lights from another nearby runway and a spigot-type gun emplacement used to defend it from attack.